Thanks so much for joining me this week for Fun Friday Teen Edition. I'm Miss Holly, and this week we're going to learn how to make animal bean art. So, the first step is to gather all of your materials. Inside your kit, you should find one cardboard sheet, a bag of variety beans, four containers of paint, one instruction sheet one container of glue, and one paintbrush. Once you have all of your materials ready, the first step is to draw your animal outline on your piece of cardboard. Um, you can do whatever animal you like. For my tutorial, I did a duck. Um, there's also some really cute gorillas, ostriches, polar bears. I've seen a lot of different animals done. Um, you can trace your animal outline with a pencil or with a marker, whatever you prefer. You don't have to get super detailed with this because your beans are going to cover it up. Once you are satisfied with your animal outline, go ahead and go through the bag of beans and begin to form the shape on top. You're going to want to do the main part of the animal's body first. In your bag of beans, you'll find several different types, such as lima beans, split peas, navy beans. So just find out what works best with the shape and size of your animal. Once you're happy with the layout you've created, go ahead and glue that down with your container of glue. Be sure not to add too much or it will become wet and warp the cardboard. Once your glue has completely dried, go ahead and apply the base layer of paint to your animal's body. Once your paint has completely dried, if you have any details you need to add to your animal, such as the beak here, Go ahead and put those on, glue them with the same process as before. Now you can go ahead and apply paint to the other body parts, such as the beak here in this photo. You might also want to fill in their eyes or nose or mouth at this point if you have any of those features you want to distinguish. So once your animal shape is completely how you want it and all the paint and glue is dry, go ahead and add your background. Um, just glue it and paint it with the same method as before. This background is just a solid pink, but I encourage you to create a fun pattern or do something else. It does not have to be solid like this. And that's really all there is to it. I hope you guys enjoy making your animal bean art. Don't forget to send a photo of your completed craft to holly.lock at haywoodcountync.gov for a chance to win a prize and be featured on our Facebook page.